Hi, this is Mike Walters with the Stern team at Keller Williams, uh, bringing you another update on our market and here to answer some questions that I think we're, we're getting uh, quite often from people that we know and trust. And the question this week is, are we going into another housing bubble? So uh, if you aren't aware of how insane our real estate market has been over the last couple of months, you've probably been living under a rock. However, uh, homes have been flying off the market and home values are spiking. And this kind of activity prompts the kinds of questions that we've been receiving as of late. So when is this bubble going to burst? That's, that's really the question, right? I mean, you've been asked that too. Um, well, will we see a, a repeat of 2008? I don't believe so, and here are five reasons why we probably won't see anything happen with home values for the next 12 to maybe 24 months. So number one, many homeowners don't even um, have loans on their home property. So over 38% of homeowners own their homes free and clear, uh, which is a very strong pillar underneath the housing market. Number two, sound economic principles. So unlike the periods of 2007 through 2009, supply and demand are acting quite natural. Supply is extremely low and demand is extremely high, which is why uh, it is complete opposite of what we saw leading up to the Great Recession. Home prices are going up and we'll probably see that continue for a while. Number three, home equity. So right now, the average homeowner in the United States has more than $200,000 in equity, which is an unprecedented amount. Number four, higher lender standards. Unlike the period of 2007 to 2009, lenders are much more critical with buyers. They're going an extra mile to ensure that everybody has the availability to repay. Those um, suspect stated income loans are a thing of the past. I don't know if you remember those. Yeah, they were a big problem of, of why we had what we did back then. And finally, forbearance. So basically, this is where a lender allows a borrower to put their payments on pause. We saw that over the last couple of years with COVID and, and the CARES Act. And while a lot of homeowners took advantage of these government back initiatives last year, 85% of those borrowers have come out of the forbearance, either repaying the balance full or enacting a special type of payment plan to get caught back up. Supply is extremely low and demand is extremely high, which is the complete opposite of what we saw in 2007 and 2008. All of those are the reasons why we're not gonna see um, a, a bubble burst like we did back then, and why right now is a great time uh, to look at selling your home. And if you're in the market to buy, buy now. Don't wait, because if you do wait, prices are probably gonna go up again. So uh, if you have any other real estate questions, feel free to call text or email us at the number on the screen. We look forward to helping you in your real estate needs.